Google has released a series of new artificial intelligence AI tools designed to be used with Gmail, Google Docs, and other products. Google has made the AI tools available for testing to developers and businesses before releasing them widely to the public. Google Cloud Chief Thomas Kurian announced the AI additions this week. The tools are designed to assist users in writing and organizing emails and creating business documents and presentations. The technology is part of a group of recently launched tools that demonstrate major AI development progress in recent years. The tools are built by feeding huge amounts of data into machine learning computer systems. The data trains the AI systems to develop complex skills and produce human like results. The technology received wide media attention last year after a company called OpenAI launched a free writing tool called ChatGPT. That tool can quickly produce human quality written documents. Experts say such systems may bring major changes to many different industries and professions. Currently, some developers and companies are able to test Google's new tools in their development and business activities. The tools make it possible for developers to create easy, safe, and scalable applications that use Google's AI technology. Like ChatGPT, Google's AI tools are designed to create fully written documents that can be used for many different purposes. For example, an employee could enter a brief description of the kind of document they want the AI system to generate or produce. The tools could then create a full marketing email, training materials, or a business plan in a few seconds. Google said its AI tools will also be able to generate brief email descriptions in Gmail, personalize business communications, and take meeting notes as part of its Google Workspace service. Workspace is a product with billions of users on free and paid accounts. Hurian told reporters during a demonstration of Google's new AI tools that he sees the system being able to provide an AI collaborator to assist human workers in real time. A video presented by Kurian suggested Google aims to have its AI transform the work of marketers, lawyers, scientists, educators, and more. However, Kurian said Google remains deeply committed to developing responsible AI. He noted that was why the company's current AI tools are being used by groups of trusted testers rather than widely releasing its new products. Last month, Google chief Sundar Pichai announced the company had developed a new AI powered tool called BARD. Google said BARD is designed to provide a better online search experience. Google currently holds more than 80% of the worldwide Internet search market, the online data company Statista reports. Google's announcement about the new AI offerings is the company's latest move to compete for business by launching ChatGPT-like technology tools. Companies like Microsoft and Meta are also heavily investing in AI-related products.
Earlier this year, Microsoft announced a new multi-billion dollar investment in ChatGPT creator OpenAI. And shortly after Google confirmed the development of BARD, Microsoft confirmed plans to redesign its Bing search engine and Edge web browser with a series of new AI tools. Technology experts have warned that while the new AI tools can generate human-like writings and other complex documents, the systems can also make mistakes. Last month, a factual mistake Bard made in a demonstration added to a $100 billion drop in the company's market value. Microsoft also faced public criticism after some users said the company's new AI tools used with the Bing search engine produced hostile and insulting results. I'm Brian Lynn. Thank you.